Now we'll go over to how to get into your file manager and why you'd want to. If I click on file browser, it'll give me two choices, local disk or external storage card. If I go into local disk, this will show me the backup we just created, Android download the IPTV client. Be sure you don't mess with anything within this file structure as it may cause trouble within your own XBMC or your Android. But if you have files saved somewhere that you want to erase, you simply just find it and erase it from this menu. The way to do that is once again go to File Browse, pick what file you want to go rid of, we'll click on this button, which allows us to select something. We'd select it, and you'll click here, which will give you a list of options, including delete and renaming it. Now, we don't suggest typically that anybody goes into this this far, but in case that you have to be walked through something like this, this is exactly where it's at. Now, we will cover how to actually use this with other wireless devices. One of the ways, if you're using a Mac or an Apple, we can go into AirPlay. AirPlay is like any other Apple or iOS AirPlay device. You'd start automatically, start AirPlay, and you would look for your target device. For other wireless devices, we have an object called Miracast. What Miracast will do is it will scan the area for wireless receiving devices. That can be anything ranging from a laptop to a TV to even a phone. Once it finds that object, you simply connect with it, and then you can play your XBMC or your Android players through your phone or TV. We have two media centers, your mix player and your media center typically don't want to play with. For those of you that are using PPOE, we also have a PPOE option. And of course Twitter and YouTube. Also, by swiping across menus, you get to other shortcuts that are down there at the bottom. As you can see, we got File Browser, Music, Android, 